Hello everyone, it's nice to have you back and welcome. This is the first part of lesson number one and today we will be discussing the trends on technology. And after completing this module, we'll be able to differentiate among laptops, tablets, desktop, and servers. Describe the purpose and uses of smartphones, digital camera, portable and digital media player, ebook readers, wearable devices, and gaming devices. Describe the relationship between data and information, explain various input options, differentiate the web from internet, and describe the relationship among web, web pages, websites, and web servers. Explain the purpose of browser, search engine, and an online social network. Briefly describe digital security risk associated with viruses and other malwares, privacy, health, and environment. Differentiate between operating system and applications. Differentiate between wired and wireless technologies and identify reasons why individuals and business uses networks, as well as discuss how society uses technology in education, government, finance, retail, entertainment, healthcare, science, travel, publishing, and manufacturing. And lastly, to be able to identify technology used by home users, small home office users, mobile users, power users, and enterprise users. Today, you can complete your homework or assignments and watch a streaming video using your laptop simultaneously. You can edit a video on your desktop and share photos online from your camera. These are just some of the technologies which are integral part of our everyday life, at school, at home, and at work. Well, technology can enable you to do more in an efficient and effective access to and search for information. You can share your personal ideas, photos, and videos. You can also communicate with and meet other people too. You can manage your finances. You can shop for goods and services. You can play games or access other sources of entertainment. You can keep your life and activities organized. You can complete business activities. Now, people who can accomplish this type of task using technology often said to be tech savvy. Therefore, technology is an enabler. Computer is an electronic device operating under the control of instructions stored in its memory that data can accept, that's your input, process the data according to specified rules, produce information, that's your output, stores the information for future use. Computer contains electronic and mechanical components known as hardware. Electronic component in the computers process data using instructions, which are the steps that tells computers on how to perform a particular task. These collections of related instructions organized for a common purpose, which referred to as programs. Using software, you can complete a variety of activities, such as search for information, type a paper, balance a budget, create a presentation, or play games. A personal computer is a computer that can perform all its tasks from input, processing, output, and storage activities by itself, and it is intended to be used by one person at a time. Most personal computers today can also communicate with other computers, other devices. Several types of personal computers include laptops, tablets, and desktops, with the first two sometimes called mobile computers. A mobile computer is a portable personal computer designed so that user can carry it from place to place. 
A user is anyone who interacts with the personal computer or mobile devices or utilizes the information it generates. A laptop, also called notebook computer, is a thin, lightweight, with a screen and keyboard attached on its base. And it's designed to fit on your lap for easy access or easy transport. Most laptops weigh around 7 pounds depending on the manufacturer and the specification. Most laptops can generate or can operate on battery or power supply or both. A tablet, usually smaller than a laptop but larger than a phone. Also a tablet is so thin, lighter weight and that has a touch screens. Like laptop, tablets run on batteries or power supply or both. However, batteries in the tablet typically last longer than those in the laptop. A desktop computer is a personal computer designed to be on a stationary state uh, locations, whereas all its component fits under a desk or a table. Another type of desktop called all-in-one. It does not contain a tower and instead it uses the same casing to house the display and the processing circuitry. A server is a computer dedicated to provide one or more services to other computers that are in the network. A network is a collection of computer and devices connected often wirelessly. Services provided by server includes storing the content and controlling the access to hardware as well as software and other resources on the network. A server can support two or several thousands of connected computers and devices at the same time. Servers are available in variety of sizes and types of, uh, for both small and large business applications. Smaller applications such as home sometimes use high-speed desktop as a server. Larger corporate, government, and web applications use powerful, expensive servers to support their daily operations. A mobile device is a computing device just small enough to hold in your hand. Because of the reduced size, the screen on mobile devices are small, often between 3 to 5 inches. Some mobile devices are internet capable, meaning they can connect to the internet wirelessly. You can exchange information between internet and the mobile device or between a computer or network and the mobile device. A smartphone is an internet capable phone that includes a calendar, an address book, a calculator, a notepad, games, and several other applications. A digital camera is a device that allows you to take photos and store the photograph images digitally. A smart digital camera also can communicate wirelessly with other devices and include applications like those with the smartphone. A portable media player is a mobile device on which you can store, manage, and play or view digital media. A digital media includes music, photos, and videos. An ebook reader short for electronic book reader or e-reader is a mobile device that is used primarily for reading ebooks an ebook or digital book is an electronic version of a printed book readable on computers and other digital devices in addition to books you can typically purchase and read forms of digital media such as newspaper and magazines these devices usually are smaller than tablets, but larger than smartphones. A wearable device or wearable is a small mobile computing consumer devices or device designed to be worn. These devices often communicate with mobile devices or computer. Wearable devices include activity tracker, smart watches, and smart glasses. An activity tracker monitors heart rate, 
measure spouts, count steps, and track sleep patterns. In addition to keeping a time, a smartwatch can communicate with a smartphone to make or answer a phone call, read and send messages, access the web, play music, work with apps, and more. With smart glasses, a user can look into an eyeglass type device to view information or to take photos and videos that are projected to a miniature screen in the user's field of vision. A uh, game console is a mobile computing device designed for single player or multiplayer video games. Gamers often connect game console to a television so that they can view their gameplay on a television screen. Many game console models are internet capable and allows you to listen to music and watch movies or view photos. Computers processes data into information and often stores the data and resulting information for future use. Data is a collection of unprocessed items which can include text, numbers, images, videos, and audio. Information convey meaning to both users. Business and home users can make a well-informed decisions because they have instant access to information anywhere in the world. A computer processes data into information. This simplified example, the item order, item price, quantity order, and the amount received all represents data. The computer process data to produce a cash register receipt. That is your information or the output. All desktop keyboards have a typing error that includes letters of the alphabet, numbers, punctuation marks, other basic keys. Some users prefer a wireless keyboard because it eliminates the clutter of cord. Keyboard for desktop contains more keys than keyboards on mobile computers and other devices. On a laptop, for example, you often use the same keys to type numbers to show various areas on a screen. Switching a key's purpose by pressing a separate key first. Instead of physical keyboard, users also can enter via on-screen keyboard or a virtual keyboard which is a keyboard that projects from a device to a flat surface. Desktop typically use mouse as their pointing device. Laptops use a touchpad. A mouse is a pointing device that fits under the palm of your hand. With the mouse, you control the movement of the pointer and send instruction to the computer or a mobile device. A touchpad is a small, flat, rectangular pointing device that is sensitive to pressure and motion. For some mobile devices and computers, able to speak data instructions using voice input, capture a full live motion image using video input. With your smartphone, for example, you will be able to use your voice to send text message, schedule an appointment, and dial a phone number. Or you may offer a video call instead of a voice call, so that you and the person you call can see each other as you chat on a computer or a mobile device. A popular type of scanner works in a manner like a copy machine. Except that instead of creating a paper, copy of the document or photo stores and scan documents or photo electronically. Printed content sometimes referred to as a hard copy or printout. Most printers today print text and graphics in both black and white, colored on a variety of paper types with many capable printing lab quality photos. A variety of printers supports wireless printing where a computer or other device communicates wirelessly within the printer. Display consists of a screen and a component that produces the information on the screen. The display for a desktop typically is a monitor, which is a separate physical device. Mobile computers and devices typically integrate the display in their same physical case. Some display have touch screens. Play vary depending on the computer or the mobile device. Most personal computers and mobile devices have a small internal speakers or speaker. Many users attach higher quality speakers to 
to their computers and mobile devices, including game consoles, so that you can only hear the sound and listen through earbuds and headphones, cover or are placed outside of the ear. Both earbuds and headphones usually include noise-canceling technology to reduce the interference of sound from the surrounding environment. Although some forms of memory are permanent, most memory keep data and instructions temporarily, which means its content are erased when the computer is off. Storage, by contrast, holds data, instructions, and information for future use. For example, a computer can store hundreds of millions of student names and address permanently. A computer keeps data, instructions, and information on storage media. Example of local storage media includes hard disk, solid state drive, USB flash drive, memory card, and optical disk. The amount of storage for each type of storage varies, but hard disk, solid state drive, and optical disk usually holds more than USB flash drive and memory card. Some storage media are portable, meaning you can remove the medium from one computer and carry it to another computer. Computers and mobile devices use a variety of style of memory card for documents, photos, and other items. A hard drive is a storage device that contains one or more inflexible circular platters that use magnetic particles to store data, instruction, and information. The entire device is enclosed in an airtight steel case to protect it from contamination. Laptops and desktop often contains at least one hard disk that is mounted inside the computer case. A solid-state drive storage device that typically uses flash memory to store data, instruction, and information. A flash memory contains no moving parts, making it more durable and shock resistance other than other types of media. For this reason, some manufacturers are using SSDs instead of hard disk in their laptops, tablets, and desktops. A USB flash drive is a portable flash memory storage device that you can plug in in a USB port, which is easily accessible opening on a computer or a mobile device. USB flash drive are convenient for mobile users because it is small and lightweight enough to be transported in a keychain or in your packet. A memory card is a removable flash memory, usually no bigger than 1.5 inch in height or in width, that you insert and remove from slots in a computer or a mobile device or a card reader or a card writer. With a card reader or writer, you can transfer and store, or you can uh, transfer the stored items, such as digital photos from a memory card or a computer or a printer that does not have a built-in uh, card slot. An optical disc is a type of storage media that consists of a flat, round, portable metal disc made of metal, plastic, and lacquer that is written and read by laser. Instead of storing data instructions information on a local drive, other prefer the use of what they call cloud storage. A cloud storage is an internet service that provides remote storage to a computer user. Types of services offered by cloud storage provides, va provides varies. Some provide storage for a specific type of media, such as photos, whereas others stores any content and provides backup service or services. A backup is a duplicate of the content on the storage medium that you can use in case, of, or in case the original is lost or damaged or destroyed. Uh, this is an example of a website that provides cloud storage solutions to home and business users.